You know, Bavaria is a state in Germany known for its natural beauty, its quaint villages, and its authentic cuisine. Well, now you can get a little slice of Bavaria right here on Delmarva. The Bavarian Bakery in Dover is a family-owned company that wants to bring their special baked goods to this community while staying true to their roots. Now, Marble Life's Sydney Whitfield got a chance to visit the Bavarian Bakery for the first time, and I'm willing to bet it won't be your last. Many siblings might find it difficult to work with each other, but brother and sister Andy Yanka and Monica Urquhart say they are just what each other need when running their Bavarian Bakery in Dover. We, we love working with each other. We, we found a passion, both of us, us have a passion where we uh, feel like at home. And their original home was in Germany, which is where they have taken a lot of inspiration to start the business they have today. We grew up in a very small town. Uh, what was standard, like in the old days, you go to the butcher, get your meat, you go to the bakery, you get your brötchen, your bread, your pastries, your cakes. So that was one thing that I always kept very high to make it the old tradition way. I make my own bread from scratch every day, every morning, every day fresh. Uh, I think people appreciate because nobody's doing that anymore. What you find now is grocery stores. They say they make sure that everything they serve is from scratch. And they mean everything, from breads to croissants to cakes. Monica says she wants the bakery to have an authentic feel. We want to make the community feel like they, we appreciate them coming in here. It's not and just like your next door. I want to, no. make it, want to make it special. Like it was in the good old days, but it's dying out now. Yeah, we want to be one of those little family-owned businesses that when you come in, you want to say, wow, that's where I want to be. That's, that's where I want to buy my pastries. That's where I want to go and buy my bread. That's where I want to buy my sandwich. You know, that's, that's kind of what we're here for. The bakery opens up at a crisp 6.30 a.m., but Andy says his preparation starts much earlier than that. I start at 11 o'clock the day before. I come at 11 o'clock at night and start baking because I want to have the bread ready to go at 6.30. So I try to almost like that the bread is still, some of them still warm. There's nothing better when you go into a place and you get a warm bread. You can't have that nowhere else. And he says he also has a lot of pride in the bakery because the building was basically abandoned for 10 years before he decided to renovate it and make it his own. It has yes. a personal touch now. Oh, yes. A lot of hard work and sweat is in here. Andy, Andy did a lot. Andy. No AC, no plumbing, no heating and it was 19 degrees. It was cold, running a jackhammer. <laughs> and then during their grand opening is when Monica says she received one of the best compliments from the daughter of the previous building owner. She was kind of sad. Emotional too. Emotional. Yeah. We all were like a little emotional that time and she told us that her mom ran Kathy's Kitchen and she would have been so proud of us on how we transformed this this building into yeah. what it is now. Monica says it's moments like those that make coming back to work worthwhile every day. It's the product that we that we bring to the community. It's the the smiles that we want to give to the community. We want we want yeah. the community to know that we are here for them. Oh wow. I hope that when uh, Sydney heads back right. to the Bavarian bakery, she takes me with her. And if you have room for one more, that'd be? Maybe, maybe two. Maybe two more. <laughs> <laughs> that'd be awesome. I, I love the accent. Uh huh. And I think I love every bit as much their passion for what they produce. Yeah. Doing things the old way. Yeah. I like that. Tradition. That means a lot. Tradition. Mm -hmm. means a lot. And if you would like to get more information about ours or location of the Bavarian Bakery, just check out our website, domarvalife.com.